Okay, here we are. Uh, this video's intent is to help you learn the low mass for one server. And this is done in a Novus Ordo Parish. Uh, we did it in this setting because this is happening a lot where uh, people and priests are wanting the traditional mass at a Novus Ordo setting. Uh, so the setup is just a bit different. Uh, there's, this is a single server mass. So you can learn how to serve the low mass as one server, one acolyte. And then we also have an additional video with two servers. Uh, it is a little bit different. Okay, so here comes our altar boy. He is going to light two candles. We light two candles for the low mass and six for high mass, sung mass, or the solemn high. Okay, he's going to genuflect. Can never give the tabernacle and our Lord too much reverence. So please make sure you are genuflecting. Also shows your sense of the real presence. Okay, so he's lighting the first candle on the epistle side, which is the right side. And he will light one candle on the gospel side, the left side. And as a note, the book starts over on the epistle side, the right side. And when you're serving by yourself, you're always opposite the book. So again, genuflecting. Here we are, we're back. Ring the bell. Altar boy takes some holy water. Gives it to the priest. Signs himself. Okay, now the altar boy takes the beretta, kisses the hand of the priest and then kisses the Beretta. It's the Beretta on the chair, comes back. Now this is, sometimes the altar boy, when it's single, is to the right of the priest or to the left. So that's something that could be a local custom. You should certainly ask your priest. There's a few things that can be adjusted. Uh, as always, you should check and be obedient to your priest. Okay, so our job is to not be a distraction. The focus is on the priest and our Lord and the Holy Sacrifice of the Mass. Okay, here we go. In nomine Patris, et Filii, Spiritus Sancti. Amen. And we have a tired day. A day of Cleo, Tificat, Juventud to Mam. Judicat me Deus, et Jesus Christ, Amen, de Gentum Sancta, Amponi Neoco, Jolosso, et Eme. Cleo to us Deus, Forty two to Mam, Quare Mera Polisti, Quare Tristi Sincedo, Dum Affligi, Ume, Inimicus. Imiti Lucian to me Vititam tuum, Ismi did the Seren, et Adoc Seren, et Mortisam tuum, et Tabernacle Tua. Et intro Uba Adotari de, a day of Cleo, Tificat, Juventud to Mam. Convit to be in Jesus, Deus, Deus Meus, Quare Tristi, et Ame, Quare Caturbus Me. Spera in Deo conium ad hoc ad fitibor ili, salutari voltus me et Deus meus. Gloria Patri, et Filio, et Spiritus Sancto. Sicutur ad in principio, et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. Ad tui voluntari Dei. Ad Deum qui latificat, juventutum meum. Ad tui nostrum non in Domini. Qui feci celum et terum. Confitio Dene Patenti, Beata Maria Servini, Veli Galicangelo, Viena Valtiste, Sainz Vols Berva, Onobus Sainz Vols Vols Vatris, Cabinimist, Cotatione Verbera Opere, Mea Copa, Mea Copa, Mea Maxima Copa, Idio Perco, Beata Maria Servini, Veli Galicangelo, Viena Valtiste, Sainz Vols Verbera, Onobus Sainz Vols Vatris, Ora Ferrum Dona Deum Nostrum. Misuratur Tui, Omnipotens Deus, et Misis Peccatis Tuis, Perducate, Ad Vita Maternum. Confidere de omnipotenti, beati Maria Semper Virgini, beati Michele Angelo, beati Ioan Battiste, Sanctus Postulus Petret Paolo, Omnibus Sanctus et Tibi Pater, quia peccavinimis cogitatione vibrato prea, mea culpa, mea culpa, mea maxima culpa. Ideo precor beati Maria Semper Virginum, beati Michele Angelo, beati Ioan Battiste, Sanctus Postulus Petret Paolo, Omnibus Sanctus et Tibi Pater, orare per me a dominum Deum nostrum. Amen. Indulgentium absolute theorem eremissionum peccatorum strong to nos and libitans and miseracles dominus. Amen. Deus tu confidus vicavis nos. Et plebs tua libertur in te. Ostendum domus and misericorum tuum. Et salatarum tuum de nobis. Domine exaterationum meum. Et clamor mea sativeniat. Dominus obiscum. Et cum spiritu tuo. Oremos. Okay, now the altar boy is going to assist by grabbing the hem of the priest's garment as he ascends the altar. 
Remember, our job is to serve. You can replay the Latin parts and responses as many times as you need to learn. 25, 50, 100. We also have an audio-only track you can listen to on a phone, MP3 player. I'm sorry, I just talked over response there. So, the altar boy is kneeling at the edge of the altar. Here comes the Kyrie. Kyrie eleison. Christe eleison. Christe eleison. Kyrie eleison. Okay, this is the Gloria. Not every Mass has a Gloria. Doesn't the priest turn around and... Again, our job is to be still, not moving, hands folded. Looking at the cross, listening. Et cum spiritu tuo. Okay, see the priest turned around, the altar boy responded. Just as a reminder, we're doing all the responses for the people. Again, we're remaining very still. Amen. The response there, it's going through the colic and then the epistle. Amen. Okay, so this is the epistle. Again, I can't recommend enough the books Treasure and Tradition, The Ultimate Guide to the Latin Mass, and another book called Know Your Mass, which is a kind of a comic book, and then, of course, the red book that we use at all the traditional masses, usually you find that. You could always borrow one or order one online for five or six dollars, or order five of them for the family, or how many you have, and read all the English and Latin. Okay, now we're, we're kind of watching for the priest's left hand. Because we don't know exactly when the reading's going to end. The left hand is our cue. And he placed, there it is. He placed it down. Deo gracias. Altar boy stands up, comes to the center. Everything's slow that we do, we never rush. Now he's going to wait until the priest moves to the center of the altar. Ascend slowly and he'll grab the book. Okay, here he goes. Up, always reverent, slow, never moving quick. Now this is a V, down, genuflect, and then up. And then he's going to set the book at a 45 degree angle. So the epistle is straight on. Et cum spiritu tuo. Sequentis angeles curum lucum. Gloria tibi domine. Okay, the priest bowed his head. That's the signal the altar boy can turn toward the tabernacle. Back to genuflect. Now the altar boy will stand at a 45 degree angle. So the priest, the altar boy, and the book are all at a 45 degree angle. There is a meaning for that, but we won't go into that in this video. So the response will be coming up at the end of the gospel. Again, a good idea to use the red book as you're watching this video. You can visually see... Okay, when the, kiss, yeah, the priest kisses the book, that's um, when you do your response. Laos Tibi Christi. 
Okay, this particular mass has a creed. Depending on your local tradition, sometimes the altar boys kneel, sometimes they stand. So you'll want to check with your local priest about that. Just make sure uh, if you're standing, right there's the kneel for et homo factus s. It comes for your tool. Okay, at that Oremus, the altar boy is going to go wait again. Pistol side. Okay, the priest is going to take the chalice veil, reach over the top, fold it in three, sometimes again, you can ask your priest how they want, and then move it out of the way. Now you're going to go down, take the cruet tops off the wine and water. The wine is always in the right hand, water in the left. And you wait for this prayer to be over. Offering of the bread. Now the priest will bring the chalice over. You come up, kiss the wine, move the water to your right hand, your left hand goes up, kiss the water, receive the wine with your left hand. And then we always kiss when we receive it back. Take it back to the credence table. Now you're going to get so you put the cruet top on the wine. Towel over your left hand as a good servant. Water cruet in the right, and the bowls in the left. Now you're waiting motionless. Remember, we do not want to draw any attention to us as servers. All the attention is on the priest, the holy sacrifice of the mass, and the miracle that's about to happen. priest will turn for the lavabo, washing of hands. Hold the bowl up, pour the water over, we'll grab the towel, move your left arm over like a towel bar. Remember, we're serving here. It's doing the lavabo prayers. Okay, so you return. I'm gonna put the cruet down, the bowl, and the towel. Put the cruet top on the water. And then you will grab the bells. The key here is not to let them ring. So practice traveling with them outside of mass so you can learn how to move without making them ring. We only want them to ring when we ring. Now, as you'll notice, you're on the opposite side of the book. All right, take five, three. Sushi piat domnu sacrificium de manuus tuis, et laudum et gloriam nomine sui, ad utilitatem quoque nostrum, totius que ecclesia sui sancte. Okay, that's the orate fratres. There's a slice pronunciation uh, problem there, but pretty good. So he's, again, equal distant on the other side now. This particular church, I think they line up on either side of the altar. So we're motionless, kneeling. This is why we wear black shoes and black pants. Spiritu tool. Habemos a dominum. Okay, you'll have to memorize those responses. You should really try to memorize the Mass before you serve. Okay, the next. 
event is the Sanctus, three bells. The priest will turn toward the center and bow, listening carefully for it. Okay, note the three short but strong rings of the bell. Let everybody know it's time to kneel. We're entering the canon. This is when the miracle happens. Te Igitur. This is especially quiet, especially important that we're not moving. Do not want attention on us at all. This is the Hank Jitur. So up, we do not kneel. Come straight up. Oh, the altar boy kneeled. Okay, that is a custom. So you may want to check with your local priest. Normally you do not kneel there at fraternity parishes and others, but I have seen variations on that. Reason being, Jesus is not yet on the altar. Now it's extremely important we hold still. We listen carefully for the words of consecration. It's amazing to be this close to this miracle. Ring once, grab the hem of the garment. A door. Three short rings again. Good strong rings. And there's the fifth ring. So one ring for kneel, three rings elevation, one ring kneel. And a profound bow there. Here it comes. Another profound bow for the for the wine. Bring the precious blood. The hem of the garment. Adore the precious blood. If you can memorize the prayer, be mindful, O Lord, thy creature whom thou hast redeemed by thy most precious blood. To the Red Book. Great prayer to say there. Okay, so now the five rings back up, come down. Now Jesus is on the altar, so we s certainly genuflect. Again, reverent. Slow to moderate pace. And back down, no ringing of the bells. Okay, this is another long, quiet part. This is known as the quiet mass.
Amen. Said Libra no Samalo. Sorry, I kind of walked over that response. <clears throat> Breaking of the bread is an incredibly special part of the Mass, too. Okay, when you hear the Agnus Dei, Lamb of God, that's when uh, we're, we're getting a little closer to the next step, which is us ringing the bells three times for the Domini Non Sum Dinius. Again, motionless. Server staying nice and still. That's good. Make sure you don't get a cassock that's too long or too short. Don't trip over it. Okay, again, three strong, short rings, then you're going to get up, go straight to the credence table, not ringing the bells, and we're going to get the patent, return to the center of the altar, again, reverent, moderate to slow pace, kneel, and you collect, walk up, and kneel again. Now at this point, some local customs do the confidier, so there's a double confidier, one at the beginning, one now. At this particular church, uh, fraternity parishes, I, I don't see them doing that, but I have seen that. So again, check with the priest. Can't possibly cover, cover all vari variations. Priestess consuming the body, blood, soul, and divinity of our Lord. Just as a side note, make sure you're making frequent use of confession in a state of grace all, at all times when we're serving the Mass. Okay, at this particular Mass, he does not have a ciborium, so he's going back to the tabernacle to get the ciborium. At this point, we are motionless, no attention on us. We should always be attentive if the priest ever has something for us to do, something's forgotten. We may be given something unusual to do, so always be prepared for that. It's traditional to strike the breast three times the Domini Nonsum Dignus, then receiving our Lord. Then stand up and move out of the way. Let the priest go first. Follow him. Left hand up. And since you are the only altar boy, 
You will be the patent for making sure our Lord does not fall. He will take the patent from you. He will ascend the altar. You can kneel or wait for the priest, priest to kneel. At this point, depending on if the priest is going to the tabernacle or not, you may not have a lot of time. This is about the only time you may have to actually say a quick prayer since you've just received our, our Lord. Definitely try to offer it up for something or someone. Okay, when the priest comes back, this is when you should stand up. Go right to the credence table, get the water and the wine. I'm sorry, just the wine on this one. And wait, the priest will tilt the chalice. That's your cue to come up. Okay, slight bow of the head. Watch out, you're pouring wine into the chalice. Purification. Okay, then you can grab the patent on the way by. Put the patent back on the credence table. Now you'll get the wine and water cruets. Again, waiting for the priest. Okay, there he turns. So you're going to... Oh, in this case, he must have a pix. So there was a water... Uh, pouring some water into the pix. Okay, now he brings the chalice with his fingers together. You're pouring wine, then water. Now the priest can separate his index finger and thumb, ensuring absolutely no particle of our Lord is lost. Okay, now you're going to come back. You do have to keep this moving, so genuflect. You're going to go all the way around. You only ascend or descend the altar directly in front if you have something in your hands. So he comes down in a V, genuflect the book, and put it to the far right corner, the epistle side. Now he's going to grab the chalice veil. Never show the back of the chalice veil to the congregation. It represents heaven, and we're not ready to see that yet. Beatific vision. Hold up the chalice veil at an angle, so your left hand is high, right hand low, so the priest can just reach over and grab the top. Bow. And now return to your position opposite the book. Excellent. If you need to make a quick adjustment, you can, but then get yourself still. Again, no focus on us. Head conspirator to him. Amen. Amen. Okay, the priest closes the book, comes back to the center and kisses the altar. Et cum spiritu tuo. Deo gratias. Now at this point, he's going to come to the gospel side and... Oh, I'm sorry, I stood to the final blessing dismissal. Amen. Okay, we stand. Et cum spiritu tuo. Gloria tibi domine. Same responses as the gospel. At this point, during the last gospel, come to the center, kneel. Head over and get the beretta. 
This is also the job of the MC during the high mass or sung mass. Standing at a 45 degree angle, the card, the priest, and the altar boy, all at 45 degrees of the altar. And there is a kneel in this gospel that you should learn. Here it comes. Again, make sure that knee hits the ground. I didn't mention that earlier, but it doesn't count if you're faking it. And there was a Deo Gracias there at the end. Okay, here comes the Leonine prayers. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother should of be God, no problem pray for us with these prayers. Now and at the hour of our death. Hopefully, Amen. you're saying the rosary Hail every Mary, day, full of grace, the Lord as is with Our Lady of Fatima asked us to do. And blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. Normally, the entire congregation cry, joins in these prayers as well. To thee do we send up our if you don't know them, make sure you learn them. Turn them, most gracious advocate, great, thine eyes of mercy beautiful toward prayers, us. Especially and this after one. this erect child, join to us the blessed the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, our refuge and our strength, that have mercy upon thy people who cry to thee. And by the intercession of the glorious and immaculate Virgin Mary, Mother of God, of St. Joseph, her spouse, of blessed apostles Peter and Paul, and of all the saints, do thou mercifully and graciously hear the prayers which we pour forth for the conversion of sinners and for the liberty and exaltation of our Holy Mother of the Church. Through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Saint Michael, the Archangel, Archangel defend us in battle. battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and snares of the devil. devil. May God and rebuke him, we humbly pray. pray. And do thou, Prince, Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the power of God, cast in hell Satan and all the evil spirits who proud about the world to our souls. Amen. Most sacred heart of Jesus. Have mercy on us. Most sacred heart of Jesus. Have mercy on us. Most sacred heart of Jesus. Have mercy on us. Okay, assist the priest, the hem of his garment. There's usually or sometimes an altar card there that you need to hand him and then take back. Now we're gonna kiss the beretta and kiss the priest's wrists when we come back up. There we go. Just a little kiss on the hand. The altar boy actually turned the wrong way there, but that's again a, cu a custom as well. Okay, and then last is extinguish the gospel candle, and then the epistle candle, and you're all set. Good work. <laughs>